I personally think Cole Komet is a super interesting tight end that people are projecting and kind of hoping he breaks out. And it kind of makes at least a little bit of sense. So coming off of last year, he was tight end 22. He had the eighth most targets, though, with 93. But he had zero touchdowns. Nothing. Like Jason scored as many as he did. He's getting the opportunity. Jimmy Graham is gone. He had three touchdowns last year, and he's finally out of a rookie quarterback in fields. Blandy Dalton, Nick Foles. That it just didn't work last year. New offense. Thank God as a Bears fan. Komet's going into year number three, and that's usually when tight ends break out unless they're freaks like, you know, Atlanta's tight end. Nasty. He's learned from one of the best tight ends of all time in Jimmy Graham for the last couple of years, and now it's time for him to perform. Komet, eighth most targets last year, 12th most catches, 12th most yards, no touchdowns. Theoretically, it's going to translate. I'm a tight end 13 just because I have other people higher than him, and I'd be willing to take a flyer late on him in drafts, even if like you normally don't draft two tight ends, right? But he could be a fun bench stash where he could be tradable if the Bears offense starts out okay. And if they start out trash, you just drop him. You at least need somebody to drop to pick up that that hot running back on the waiver wire after week one or two. So with all that being said, I'm at 13, just ahead of Kyle Rudolph, Hunter Henry, Pat Fryermuth, Tyler Higby, behind Tanyan, behind uh, Dawson Knox. He's a he's a fun potential breakout tight end this year.